Welcome to the Mathematics in my channel. In this video, we are going to solve this interesting integral. Well, uh, how to begin? Okay, first of all, here we have x times here infinite product. So, uh, first we should evaluate this infinite product. Okay, uh, if we take uh, product uh, in is equal 1 to k here infinity now i'm going to take k uh, cosine of x over 2 raised to the n uh, we can write this is equal to when n is equal 1 cosine of x over 2 then cosine of when x is a, n is equal to cosine of x over 4 then cosine of x over 8 and we know this is going to cosine of x over 2 raised to the k okay uh, now uh, how to uh, evaluate uh, this product okay first of all uh, i am going to begin with sine of x so we know sine of x is equal to double angle formula 2 times sine of x over 2 cosine of x over 2 then uh, again if we apply double angle formula for sine of x over 2 uh, we have uh, 2 so again 2 so 2 square uh, sine of x over 4 cosine of x over 4 and here we have cosine of x over 2 okay again if we apply double angle formula for sine function here we have 2 raised to the 3 power sine of x over 8 cosine of x over 8 cosine of x over 4 here cosine of x over 2 okay now uh, here we have a pattern and uh, if we take uh, kth time we can write here 2 raised to the k uh, sine of x over here we have 2 2 square 2 raised to the 3 power and here we have 2 raised to the uh, k power and here we have uh, product uh, this product we can write this is equal to uh, product uh, from uh, n is equal 1 to k cosine of x over 2 raised to the n okay then um, here sine of x now we can isolate the uh, this product so we can write uh, now uh, product n is equal 1 to k cosine of x over 2 raised to the n is equal to now here we have sine of x sine of x over 2 raised to the 2 raised to the here 2 2 raised to the k power times sine of x over 2 raised to the k okay now uh, here we have k uh, but uh, we need to want to infinity infinite product therefore uh, we can take uh, we can apply limit so we can write now limit uh, here uh, now k approaches to infinity limit k approaches to infinity uh, product n is equal 1 to k cosine of x over 2 raised to the n cosine of x over 2 raised to the n and here uh, the side also limit k approaches to infinity uh, sine of x over 2 raised to the k times sine of x over 2 raised to the k now here we know uh, product n is equal 1 to infinity cosine of x over 2 raised to the n is equal to now sine of x uh, we can write outside of the limit and here uh, limit k approaches to infinity here 1 over 2 raised to the k over sine of x over 2 raised to the k okay now uh, here we know uh, 0 over 0 form so we can apply uh, l hospital's rule so here sine of x uh, limit k approaches to infinity now uh, derivative with respect to k 1 over 2 raised to the k here uh, we know uh, derivative of sine we know cosine of 
x over 2 raised to the k then uh, uh, here x constant x times now here uh, derivative with respect to k 1 over 2 raised to the k okay then uh, we know this part uh, get cancelled and we have sine of x over here x and here uh, limit k approaches to cosine of x over 2k we know 1 so we have infinite product is equal to sine of x over x so we can write i is equal to integral from 0 to pi over 4 uh, x times sine of x over x dx and x get cancelled and we know sine of x uh, cosine of x uh, sorry integration of sine of x minus cosine of x from 0 to pi over 4 now if we apply limit uh, we know 1 minus 1 over square root of 2 okay this is the answer if you like this video please subscribe this channel thank you for watching